Hey guys, how's it going? So today we're going to be making the uh, support fixture um, and it is chapter 5, exercise 5. So uh, the way that I would go about building it is I would start uh, down here at uh, uh, the bottom and we'll draw this uh, piece here and we'll extrude it the one inch like it says it is and then we'll come to the right hand uh, sketch plane and we'll draw this uh, side piece here um, going over the top and then come back down right here and we will uh, extrude it uh, through and then once we're done with that we'll come to this front piece uh, here we'll draw this uh, circle here and extrude it the uh, two inches and then we'll do this uh, two inch uh, diameter hole right here and we'll cut that all the way through So here's the piece that I was talking about. So we're going to build this piece here, extrude it, come on the side, draw this piece right here and extrude it, come to the front, draw this circle right here and extrude it, and then we'll draw this circle and then extrude cut it. So we'll go on ahead and start a new part drawing. Go to sketch, come to the front plane, and I'll start with a center rectangle. And then we'll get a three point arc. We'll click the top, click the bottom, and then just draw it out. And then the same thing over here on the left. We need to highlight this point in this line and make them coincident. And the same thing over here. Now we can dimension the width. So we can see on the drawing it's seven inches from center of the circle. So that width right there is seven inches and this height it doesn't explicitly give us, but it shows us the radius of the left hand arc is 1.5, which means that the height is three. Now we can put these center circles in and dimension those to 1.5. And then we can extrude this through now. And it says it is says right here that our extrusion depth is one inch and then if your uh, selected contours are not there you can click this box down here and then we're going to select these parts as our extrusion all right and now we see our three principal planes right here so we're going to click this right plane and click this sketch or you can select that plane come to sketch tab and click sketch and now we're going to be looking at this drawing from the right hand side so now we're going to draw this piece right here we're going to zoom out some so this point is going to start right there come over and doing the arc trick i taught you in the last video come back over the point until you see that circle and then pull up until you see the arc Those are going to be in line. Same with that point. Back to this face and then up to close the drawing. This is one inch thick on the bottom and on the top so we can make this line and this line equal length. We need to make these arcs uh, tangent with each other so that one was, or these arcs and lines tangent with each other so that one was already done. And these two and lastly, this one's already done. We can set the radius. And it shows us right here that the width from this front face to the inside part of this line is 2.25 inches. And that's the center of this circle, which is gonna be the top of this line that we just drew to this top face right here is going to be uh, excuse me, to the midpoint of this face that we drew the first time is going to be five inches. So, so this one, so from here to here is 2.25. And then from this top line to the midpoint of this is going to be five inches. So you can either click this um, uh, origin here if you did a um, midpoint rectangle or you can hover over this line here until the midpoint dot shows up. Five inches, now it's fully defined. Now we can go to extrude. 
and then we see that it is four inches uh, across and we get that based on that uh, diameter right there and we're going to set it to four inches and make sure that we select mid plane extrude so that will split the difference in half on either side now that that part's done we're going to do a sketch on this front face right here and we're going to draw a circle this time instead of an arc so we're going to hover over this line until we see the midpoint draw a circle and then it is diameter of four now we're going to extrude this two inches but not mid plane we're going to go from the sketch plane blind and then we're going to need to make sure that it's going backwards so flip that around by clicking that arrow and then lastly we need to cut the hole through the middle so we can go to sketch click that face again draw another circle and then we're going to hover over this edge of the arc until we get the midpoint and we see that the radius excuse me the diameter is two and then we can go to extruded cut make sure the middle part selected through all and that is it for the sport fixture comment if you have any questions